Hey guys, Packy goes back with a new video. Today I'm gonna to be talking about Optree. Now, if you're familiar with my channel and my last videos, you've probably seen me recommending Optree as my chosen product to recommend. Part of that is because I can't recommend you any VPN affiliate links uh, because I just don't think it's a very honest industry. I think almost all the VPNs are corrupt in some way or another but most VPNs have some kind of concerning affiliate marketing. So I've decided that I will recommend other tools outside of the uh, VPN industry that you also might be interested in as a way to kind of help the channel stay funded, um, even though we're, we're not really making any money yet. But outside of that, Doug, why am I recommending Opry? Why do I think it's the best one? Well, in this video, we're gonna go into an in-depth explanation as to why. Now guys, in a lot of ways, you could check out my GitHub for uh, this kind of um, review system. Uh, basically what I've done is have taken a couple other different methodologies and kind of um, debastardized them. Let's just put it that way. A lot of these, um, I've seen a couple different tables out there like this. Some of them are promoting incogni, some are promoting uh, delete me. Some of them are not using, well, none of them are actually using the weighting system. I think I innovated on this table methodology and the weighting system. Some things are more important to other things. I've added a couple of categories and so forth. So that is definitely why my system is the best. Well, in my humble opinion. But if we take a look at the data, we can kind of go on a break by breakdown, um, you know, which why Optry is better than some of the other ones. Well, what I, I would say, let's let's start off with the cons. Let's be objective here. I, I think one con of Optry is that it doesn't really seem to offer a family plan. I, I'd say that is the con. Other services like Incogni do offer a family plan. So if you're someone looking for tons and tons of, uh, you know, your entire family, it might be better to go with the other ones. But honestly, at the same time, the bonus with Optree is that two of the core plans is actually cheaper than some of the other family plans. So that is something you need to think about. Uh, if you pay yearly, for example, one plan here is $39. And some of the family plans with other options like Incognia are actually around $120 or so. So honestly, does it need a family plan? Well, maybe not. Um, so that is something interesting to actually think about with um, Optree. Um, so we can kind of take a look at some of the other things that it does really well. So one thing, um, you know, Optree does have that a lot of others have is manual data removal. Now, ARA, IGX, Complete, Avast, EVG, some of these ones do not have manual removal. So it is a category to kind of think about, but not really too much. Optree does have a 30-day refund policy, which is better than competitors like Delete Me. So that's something to think about for sure. See, as you can see here, 30-day money-back guarantee, cancel at any time. So that's actually kind of unique. Um, so um, Delete Me doesn't offer that. Delete My Info, OneRamp, uh, OneRamp also kind of used to own the websites that it now removes from. So watch out for that. Um, Optree also has a very good reputation. There hasn't really been anything concerning about its pricing plans or anything like that. It's won a couple of awards and stuff like that too. I've talked to the team myself, very friendly people, and they honestly just seem like a really good company trying to make the best tool possible. Doesn't really seem like they're focusing on other side products, um, like some of these other companies on various different things. Based in the United States, um, a transparent team as well. So definitely very solid. We can take a look at some of the other categories as well. Whoops, I just kind of messed that up. Um, so for example, affordability. Why is Optree better than other options out there? Well, affordability, let's take a look and compare. Optree's core plan, 370 websites, $40 a year. So let's go ahead and take a look at some competitors. So before we go too much into the individual pricing differences between Optree and some of the other ones, I do kind of want to show that setup process to kind of show you guys what it looks like since I haven't really done that so far here on the channel. When you first start up, it's going to say here, basically you don't even have to pay when you're first starting up. It's going to show you where your data might be showed online if you want to submit opt-outs or if you want to upgrade to a paid plan. So it's kind of nice that it gives you this option to just directly kind of start up an account without actually paying. But if you do go to this um, upgrade plan here, this is kind of what you'll see. Um, definitely some of your um, information here you want to put in. And then your promo code here. So if I put in Packet Ghost, um, we can see the discount, there you go. So a nice little 20% discount. So 319 times, it's actually me $38, just a small little discount, but still nothing to scoff at. So for one year, it'll be $30. And Cogni's is actually $100 a year. 
So almost three times as expensive. Um, you also have the other plans too, but those are even more expensive. And uh, Delete Me doesn't really seem to have a pricing page. You just click on ball, but Delete Me is $130 a year. So almost four times as expensive. And now you're starting to see why Optory is so much better. You can get Optory's extended plan um, for 530 websites and Delete Me's um, basic plan it doesn't even say how many websites it does. Nice, G good job, delete me. Um, so it doesn't say here, it doesn't say here, doesn't really say, doesn't say. So we'll go ahead and kind of show you around Op3 what it looks like. Um, so you have the plan section here is where you could pay. We have the managed family section. Oh, so you can actually do additional discounts for family. I didn't even actually um, really click on to pay attention to this before since it's not on the page. So Wow, so fame and members get an additional 30% off. Um, so you could kind of invite them to your plan and you get stocking discounts. So a better deal, very nice. So we have the report section. Um, so this will be your first report. Um, so a way for that. We have custom removals and this is available in the ultimate plan. Another thing I really like about Optory that sets it apart from competitors is they will not tell websites your information unless they actually have it. And it will provide you with screenshots and results here, which other providers do not show. So really, really nice. So pretty much what you do is you fill out your profile. This will include information about these various things. You don't have to fill out every single one, but the more you fill out, the more accurate it will be. Once you do that, you can go ahead and um, scan. So we'll quick scan now to see kind of what goes on. So there we go, we're scanning. But guys, for example, if you use my promo code, you can also get up to $30 off the extended plan, which covers one of the 500 websites and is better than Delete Me and Incogni both. So a very good deal. So guys, next up after you pay for your plan, this is what you will see. Um, you go to manage profile, you fill out the information if you haven't done that already, you get tuned for some updates um, and return to dashboard to track the progress and you'll see what your plan includes here. So we'll go ahead and go to the dashboard. Um, so as you can see here um, in this extended plan I purchased for this video, um, we're gonna get 274 websites, which is pretty good. Um, you can also upgrade coverage if you want to this one. This one is quite pricey. It's around $250 a year. Um, I don't know if this one is honestly necessary, um, but if you have the money and you want to scare move from like almost every website in existence, maybe this one could be worth the purchase. Um, but yeah, this is what it looks like. We could see various things pending now and we can see websites that um, might also have information about you. Um, so you could see which plan it's covered from. Um, and stuff like that. You can see the removals in progress. So once you do that, check back later. So now we've kind of done a good overview of what it's like to set up Optry. We explained clearly why it's more affordable. There's more options in the plans. There's a free plan to just kind of test things out. There's a wide variety of extended options. All of them have a really good promo code. And these other ones don't even really offer promo codes. Another thing, like I mentioned, is Opry provides proof-based reporting. Um, as you could see in this area um, right here, you could see the, the, the screenshots of various kind of stuff. And um, once you will get removals, you'll get more. And then um, another thing I really like is Opry does not own review sites. Other kind of options like Incogni, which are really popular, um, you can actually find reviews from them done by um, pretty much investments from the companies they own. Let me show you here. So we'll go to YouTube, type in Incogni Review and see what we could find. Um, so we have a couple of these, Shield Channels. But here we go, Cyber News. So Cyber News is ranking for an Incogni Review. And if you look in the video right here, it says, um, Cyber News is owned by MediaTek, whose investors are North Security. North Security owns both Surfshark and Nord. Um, and Incogni, so there you go, owns and has investments in this review. So definitely, I hate this kind of thing. Um, definitely not my favorite look for one of these. And Offtree doesn't do that, so that is one thing I like about them. And I think it's important to be transparent about that as well. 
uh, for these companies. Since if you see a good review by Opterate, you know it doesn't have like an ownership stake in it, like this one. So guys, check out my link in the description down below. You code Path Kit Ghost if you want to help support the channel. And goodbye.